Um, okay, so what I was saying, okay, so for so every year I will always buy I will go to Menards. I don't know if they have Menards down there. No, I've never heard of this place. What is it? So Menards is kind of like Lowe's. Have you heard of Lowe's? Uh like a home Home Depot? Home Depot, yes. Yeah, yeah. So Menards is Home Depot, but it's like West Wisconsin. Ah, uh, okay. Uh, but it's in like the more Midwest area. It was born in Wisconsin. By the way, Menards best store I've done. So I'll go to Menards and I will get into line and I will um <laughs> another strange story here while we're bringing this up. <laughs> so I will always um I will always buy a a box of Hershey king size bars. Now everyone knows every Christmas they will get from me as a single Hershey chocolate bar that is wrapped up, of course. I would not give it to anybody not wrapped up. That would be disrespectful. <laughs> but the one time I, uh, the one time I gave, like, oh, here's a Hershey bar. And then he's like, oh, come outside. And I was like, okay. So I brought the Hershey bar. Oh, here is a microphone stand with a microphone. And I was like, um, your thing is in the mail. Oh. This is for now. <laughs> so. Oh my gosh! <laughs> so I was like, dude, like, what the frick, man? Like, <laughs> like what? And I was, I was kind of happy, but kind of upset at the same time. Yeah. So mor moral of the story is don't get Claude anything nice. <laughs> you're, you're too nice though, Claude. I would have just given him the candy bar. <laughs> And called it a day. <laughs> no, that's that's like that would be somewhat disrespectful because like how would like? But when I was getting to with the chocolate bars, I did go out with a girl briefly, and she's like, "Why are you buying all these chocolate bars?" And I was like, "If you want to go on a date with me, I'll give you one." And she, <laughs> so I don't. Wait, like, you got I'm someone gonna... to go on a date with you by giving them a chocolate bar? Pretty much. That's pretty cool. <laughs> I didn't know I was, that worked. <laughs> so how, like, see, the thing is, the thing, <laughs> see, the thing is, it's not the fact that I bought a chocolate bar. The thing is, I bought a bunch of chocolate bars. So they're like, oh, where are you, like, what are you doing with all these? You know, like, yeah. you get in the line and yeah. you buy stuff that people are like, oh, and then we can insert a, a bunch of adult jokes Wait, now. Wait, you picked up this and girl then, in the line at the store? Oh, no, she worked there. What? <laughs> that's yeah, some, so, that's some skills right there. So like I was like, oh, and was, like we just like hit it off, I guess. And then we went bowling a couple times, and then it didn't go through. But long story short, you gotta buy something in mass quantity, guys, and you can get whoever you want to go out with. <laughs> and it has to be something random. It can't be. It can't be something like. See, for example, like I, for example, I did, we didn't with this girl, but we, so me and my friends all, we all, um, we're going to go back to our original house. So you, I, th we, I think you should, I think you should teach classes in this class. It's, how to yeah, pick, I'm not, how to pick up women with a box of chocolate bars. You got to buy stuff in mass quantities. If you're going to Menards and you're buying nails and like, uh, caulk for your walls and your drywall and paints you're not gonna get no girl or guy <laughs> you gotta go to like a store and you need to go buy like a bunch of something that somebody should not be buying a bunch of <laughs> for example pop chocolate if zach so i'm saying if you go into the register the cashier and they and you, you're buying Halloween candy. They're not gonna bat an eye. But say you're going to go buy yourself a bunch of chocolate bars. That's all. That's all I know. That's what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. It doesn't have to be the cashier, wait, by the way. Wait, wait, wait. Is it this... doesn't have to be the cashier, by the way. It could be anybody that works at the store. Is, is because this... the people at the store have to kind of interact with you. Yeah. Is... So you can't get shut down. Is this <laughs> another life lessons with Claude segment? Yes, I, I guess. <laughs> So it's just it's just hit or miss. If you keep going and you keep attempting, one day you can date somebody that is making minimum wage at a store. <laughs> I guess that's the way to put it, right? <laughs>